Hi, this is Eric with Celestron, coming to you from Celestron headquarters in Torrance, California. We recently launched our StarSense Explorer 12-inch Dobsonian, the largest aperture telescope available with the exciting StarSense Explorer functionality. To best protect the big primary mirror during shipment, the mirror is pre-installed in its cell and packaged in a separate box. As part of assembling your scope, you'll need to install the mirror cell into the optical tube assembly. It's a simple one-time procedure. In this video, we'll walk you through the process step by step. First of all, work in a clean, well-lit area. I recommend placing a piece of cardboard on the floor to create a work surface. First, remove the optical tube assembly and the mirror cell from their packaging. Remove the plastic wrap and tissue paper from the mirror cell so that the primary mirror surface is exposed. Try not to get any dust or particles on the mirror surface. Next, turn the optical tube assembly upside down so the exposed edge of the tube is facing upwards. Now, lift the primary mirror cell, turn it upside down, and position it over the end of the tube. You may feel uncomfortable doing this, but the mirror clips will retain the mirror within the cell when positioned upside down. Avoid touching the mirror surface as you do this. Then, lower the mirror cell onto the end of the tube so the threaded holes in the edge of the mirror cell line up with the through holes in the end of the tube. It's okay if the holes don't line up perfectly. You can adjust by slightly moving the mirror cell relative to the tube. But if the holes are too far misaligned, it may be easiest to lift the mirror cell off the tube and try again. The tube may form an oval shape due to its large diameter, preventing the mirror cell from properly seating onto the tube. If this happens, try hugging the tube into a more circular shape with one arm while repositioning the mirror cell with your free hand. Once the tube end is sufficiently round, the mirror cell will drop into place. After the mirror cell is on the end of the tube with the holes lined up, use the six screws supplied in the mirror cell box to fasten them together. Keep the screws loose initially, as you may still need to slightly reposition the cell relative to the tube. Firmly tighten the screws after they have all been installed. The primary mirror and cell are now installed into the optical tube. They should not need to be removed again except for periodic cleaning. Please refer to the instruction manual online for more information. For best performance, use a supplied collimation cap to check optical alignment after mirror installation. Likely, you'll need to adjust the tilt of the primary mirror using the thumb screws on the mirror cell. Again, please refer to the instruction manual online for more information. We know you'll be amazed at what you can find and see with your StarSense Explore 12-inch Dobsonian. Now, you'll just need to wait for those next clear skies.